to me it's been interesting and something I've emphasized in my students that the geologic framework of mostly southern and central Arizona was built by USGS geologists in great part who were studying mining districts. Uh, they were not mining geologists, they were just geologists and they put the stratigraphy together, the paleontology together, the structural geology together in a framework in a state that survives today. A hundred years ago they were doing this. They were working all day long, they were writing their notes at night according to B.S. Butler with whom I studied when I came here. And the notebooks were sent back to Washington where they were transcribed by secretaries into professional papers. And we still use those professional papers as references. And in 50 years, and I think it's applicable here now, today, when I read the journalists' accounts of mining ventures in this region, is that the deposits have become progressively bigger and bigger and bigger and bigger. They have not grown smaller and there's not been a limit on them and they've not stopped mining. Uh, what was once waste and declared so by government uh, pronouncements, they now call ore piles because they're leaching ore piles <laughs> instead of waste. Mm -hmm. and so now it's just ore stockpiles is what they call them. So uh, the, the advances have been metallurgical and, and going after these things. So it's really kind of the, the geologic activity it's still out there, but it's not what it was. The high, high water mark, I'm sure, was reached in about 19, say from about 1968 or 1970 to about 1985. There was a big drop in copper prices and deflation of the industry in about 1980 or 82, but it picked up again slowly to the point where it is now. The, the copper reached the low during the Depression 1920, uh, 1931, 32, of five and a half cents a pound is now worth over three and a half dollars a pound. So we see cycles of this in employment and unemployment in school because when they, when the folks get laid off, they come back to school. So <laughs> we've been able to track this.